Hi everyone, I'm Jay. Welcome to my channel. Today I'll show you how I made this delicious beef hot pot. I'll begin by preparing my vegetables. First I'll start by peeling and slicing one medium sized onion. I'll peel and chop one large carrot. I'll dice the carrot into medium sized pieces. I'll add some swede as well, so I'll dice and peel half a swede. I'll peel and roughly chop three cloves of garlic. I've peeled and washed a couple of potatoes and now I'm just going to thinly slice them. After slicing the potatoes, I'll cover them with water. Finally, that's the last of the veg prep. I'm heating up a tablespoon of olive oil in my saucepan and I'm just going to fry the onions off. I'm just going to keep the onions moving under a medium heat until they're nice and soft. After a few minutes, the onions are lovely and soft and now I'm just going to transfer them to a bowl. I've added a little more oil to my pan and now I'm going to add the diced beef. I've allowed the beef to cook for a few minutes before adding two tablespoons of flour. I combine the flour into the beef before I crumble in one beef stock cube. Now I'll cover with boiling water from the kettle. I've turned the heat up at this point to allow to simmer and I'll just give it a good stir. Next I'll add one tablespoon of tomato puree. And I'll go in with a tablespoon of Worcester sauce. Now I'll return the onions to the pot and also add the chopped vegetables. Now I'm going to add a few herbs and spices. So I'm going to add one teaspoon of white pepper, ground black pepper, one and a half teaspoons of rosemary, one teaspoon of thyme. I find the stock to be salty enough, but that's just my personal taste. So I tend not to add salt at this point. Mm -hmm. 
So I just give everything a good stir through and I'm gonna add a splash more hot water. I'm going to add two freshly chopped tomatoes. You could use tin for this as well. I've allowed the stew to simmer for about 10 minutes on the stove before I transfer it to an oven proof dish. Now I simply just layer all the potatoes from earlier on top. I'm just scattering some blobs of butter on top of the potatoes. Now I'm just sprinkling a pinch of rosemary on top. Okay, that's all done. Now I'm gonna pop the lid on, place it in the oven at 180 Celsius to cook for one hour. If you've no lid, tin foil will work just as well. Okay, so it's been an hour now. I'm just going to take the lid off and pop it back in the oven to cook for a further 40 minutes to crispen up the potatoes. And there it is, your beef hot pot. Tender flavoursome pieces of beef in a deliciously rich sauce topped with crispy potatoes. I hope you've enjoyed today's recipe. Please like and subscribe for more delicious recipes like this. Thank you so much for watching. Take good care of yourselves and I'll see you in the next one. Thank you for watching.